woke up. Well, I've been up for a while, but I'm not doing it today. Um, so first and foremost, happy evolution week. <laughs> okay. Um, for me, a week is Sunday to Sunday. So for me, this week is the 21st to the 28th. And I'm super excited because the, because the WWE is airing a special on the road to evolution tonight after all and it's on the network and it's on usa um and i said that i hope that they do one for this week so for this week i mean sunday to sunday so because that will cover raw smackdown both nxts maybe the main maybe the main young classic and um the pay-per-view itself and media of course so that's what I mean when I say I hope that they do a special for this week for Evolution, which I hope they do and I hope that they will. Um, when it comes to the videos um, this week, you're going to get quite a lot from me. First match reviews, I'm going to do three. This one, one on Thursday, and one the morning of Evolution, okay? So three match reviews. Um... You're going to, on Wednesday, you are going to get my Raw, SmackDown, and NXT UK review. You're also going to get my Mayan Classic review. On Thursday, you're going to get my Women's Comments reviews because none of the rumors really in interest me like that. And if there's any comments that interest me after I do those, after I do that video, then I'll talk about those on my pay-per-view talk video on Friday. And then I'm going to do my, um, my, um, match. And then on Sunday, I'm going to do my evolution review, okay? So, quite a lot of videos, and like I said last week, I'm not going to do Total Divas reviews anymore. Um, if something interests me on the show, I may talk about it in my next video after the show, but I'm not going to do a full review. But yeah, I'm really excited for Raw tonight, I'm really excited for the special, I'm just excited. It's Evolution Week, I'm excited. Um, now, when it comes to this match, this is Cherry... Versus Hikaru Shada, I think her name is. Um, it's from Japan. And everyone knows I don't watch the Indies or none of that. But I did want to broaden my horizon and broaden my thoughts and all of that. And everyone knows that my favorite student, Nikki Bella, she will always be my, my number one. And everyone knows that I am a huge Divas fan. I don't feel like wrestlers are better simply because they come from the Indies. Um, and everyone knows that I don't watch the indies, but I do support women's wrestling. So I decided to look up a lot of indie stars and all of that. And I've actually gotten quite a lot of matches from them. So we have a mixture of old school, new school, divas era, indie era, Japanese, all that. So, yeah. So this is going to be my first Japanese review. Um, depending on how the commentary is, since it's in Japanese, I don't understand Japanese. I'll probably, I'll probably leave it on because I've watched a couple of their matches and it don't bother me that much, especially because just like in English there, you could tell that they're excited and that they're happy and that they're, you know, really in tune with the match and I'm okay with that. So, yeah, but I've only seen a couple Japanese matches in full so i'm excited to watch this one it's the first one okay that was a uh That's how you say their names. Huh. Yeah. Ooh. 
I'm guessing the one in pink is Sherry. It's Cherry. That was a nice little reversal. Haikuru came out swinging, boy. Ooh. That was nice. I've noticed that a lot of Japanese wrestlers like like to do the northern the northern lights uh suplex and they do the bridge. I like that. Ooh, cherry spicy. It's a good map so far. Oh, she has a. Ooh, that was a nice drop toe hold. And she did it from the front instead of the back. That was really nice. about that guys this <sighs> literally had to put on pants and some more shit like this is what I hate when you bring people up to meet you make sure that they know the right fucking door I'm sorry about that y'all sorry <sighs> but let me show y'all how she did this drop toe hold really good I like it it's not anything you know ultra out in the world but I really liked it I normally see people do it from the back instead of from the front Nice missile drop kick from the top rope. She put a Kindle stick. Ooh. 
Oh, what is she doing? I think this may be developmental for Japan because they're not hitting each other as hard as I've seen Japan girls hit. Nice Hurricane Rana. Yeah, it's definitely a developmental. You can tell that they're still learning. Ooh! Let me see what that was, because that was really cool. I like that. Really like that. Ooh, near fall. Ooh, big boot. <laughs> Good match. Haikaru won. Um, so that was a really, really nice little match. Um, you can tell that they were still in developmental. Um, you could tell that they were still learning because they didn't hit as hard as I've seen Japanese women hit. Um, but you can tell that they pick up what they know really fast and that the mistakes that they made in the beginning, they fixed at the end. They fixed throughout the match. Um, so yeah, really good match. I have no issues with it. The commentary didn't bother me. Um, I was laughing with them, you know, um, I figured some of the spots that they were calling were probably spots from the match, like, especially in, in the beginning, the talking fast and stuff, because there was suplexes and all that stuff going on. But yeah, not a bad match at all. Um, if this is any indication of what the Japanese women have to offer, I'm definitely excited to start, um, to start, uh, reviewing those matches. There's a few matches that are like an hour and 50 minutes long. I'm not sure if I'm going to review those or not. But if I do, just bear with me, okay? <laughs> but yeah, nice match. I liked it. Um, I'm excited to see what they have to offer. So, well, this got me excited to see more of Japanese women's wrestling. So... Um, everyone knows that WWE is still my number one, but I'm excited to see, you know, other Verizons, other all that. So yeah, um, that was my match review for today. And, um, I'm probably going to watch some stuff on the network and a couple of other movies before Raw starts. So I will see you guys later. Bye.